Yo, what's good, Milk Man? All right, both streams should be back up and running. Go ahead and double check here. Yeah, okay, we're back. There were a lot of uh, odd games back in the N64 era. Yeah. Uh, what was your favorite one? I always really enjoyed the uh, Conker's Bad Fur Day and like um, Banjo-Kazooie. A lot of the rare games were pretty cool. All right, let's go ahead and erase our save file named Long. Goodbye. Name it again as Long. Here we go. In the vast deep forest of Hyrule, long have I served as the guardian spirit. I am known as the Deku Tree. Uh, the children of the forest, the Kokiri, live here with me. Each Kokiri has his or her own guardian fairy. However, there is only one boy who has not have had a fairy. <laughs> Navi, Navi, where art thou? Come here. So I only had a few back then, uh, 007, Donkey Kong, Star Wars, Racing, and of course Zelda. Oh, Navi, the fairy, listen to my words, the words of the Deku Tree. Dost thou sense it, the climate of evil descending upon this realm? Bellet forces, even now, are mustering our attack our land of Hyrule. For so long, the Kokiri Forest, the source of light, has stood as a barrier deteriorating outsiders and maintaining the order of this world. But before this tremendous evil power, even my power is as nothing. It seems the time has come for the boy without a fairy to begin his journey. The youth whose destiny it is to lead Hyrule into the path of justice and truth. Navi, go now. Find our young friend and guide him to me. I do not have much time left. Fly, Navi, fly. The fate of the forest, nay, the world, depends upon thee. Interesting. So, I actually never had 007 growing up. I did play through Donkey Kong, though. Uh, Star Fox 64 was pretty fun, though. You know, crazy enough, a lot of those games from the N64 era either got remakes or... Um, 
they've been ported to other consoles, like the Nintendo Switch Online. All right, so Nobby's trying to find Long. Oh, it bonked his head onto the onto the railing here. Hello. Hello, Long. Wake up. What if I don't want to wake up? Hmm. You ever thinking about that, Nobby? Uh, the great Deku tree wants to talk to you. Lonk, get up! Hey, come on! Can Hyrule's destiny really depend on such a lazy boy? What if I want to be a lazy boy, huh? You finally woke up! I'm Navi the Fairy! The great Deku tree partner... Uh, the great Tiku Tree asked me to be your partner from now on. Nice to meet you. Uh, yeah, my grands bought me a uh, Donkey Kong uh, bundle for Christmas. The only t the only game I got for your birthdays and Christmas, I ended up getting the GameCube. But at that point in age, I started sports and was never home. Then RuneScape became a thing. Ah. Yeah, what's going on, Triforce? The great Tiku Tree has summoned you. So let's get going right now. Chat, for those of you who are watching this VOD back, um, we had to end stream after 30 minutes of gaming because I accidentally rolled and Link picked up the heart piece from Goma. So we are redoing it again. Yahoo! Hi, Link, or Lonk. Three hearts challenge, right? Not four hearts? Yes, sir. It is a three heart, not a four heart challenge. All right, chat. We got to go get 40 rupees up real fast. Get the, the Deku shield again. Ah, uh, fam, because we walked in there. <laughs> There's no roll. Shush, try horse. It was an accident. <laughs> Watch chat, now we're not going to get lucky at all. And what's going to happen here is all of our rupee pieces are just going to be single ones. We're not going to get any fives or tens. Nah, bro, how did you actually think of a big glowing heart? I guess we'll never know. RNG? Nah. Uh, we're doing a three heart challenge with a friend of mine named Soupy Ghost. If you don't know who he is, he actually streams over on Twitch and on YouTube now. <clears throat> also, I got a question for you, chat. So, I'm collecting games that I never had the chance to play when I was a kid. Um... And I've recently started rebuilding back my library of PS2 games, right? But now I want to start getting into Xbox 360 games. What were you guys' favorite Xbox 360 games growing up? I was super into Call of Duty during those times, so I really didn't, like, waver outside of, like, certain genres of gaming on the Xbox 360. It's also kind of crazy that the Xbox 360 is considered retro now. Like, to me, that's crazy. Right? Call of Duty and Halo were super big back then. And that's, like, what I mostly played. When I wasn't playing Halo 3 ODST, I was playing Call of Duty Black Ops. Uh, better be quick with uh, some games that have DLC. With the 360 shop going offline in a few months, that's why I'm trying to rush and get as many as I can now. I mean, let's be real, chat. A lot of these games are super cheap right now, between like 10 and 20 bucks. I'd like to hurry up and get 
you know, a head start on that before those games start reaching like $80, $100 a piece. Have you ever played Too Human? Too Human. I don't think so. I've played um, Detroit Become Human. Yeah, I think uh, I did buy a buying guide for the Xbox 360. Really? I need to go and collect the other uh, Xbox 360 variants. I have the original fat Xbox 360, the white one, but I want to get the the last model, the one that kind of looks like an Xbox One. I think that's the Xbox 360E, the E variant. So that's on like my to-do list, is to get that one going. Okay, those are all hearts. I don't need any hearts right now. <clears throat> now, if I remember correctly, it's the house over here to the right that has all the monies in the chests that we need. Oh yeah, MBL, how's your playthrough of Spider-Man 2 going? Are you enjoying it? Chat, for those of you who don't know, um, MVL Gaming is doing a playthrough of Spider-Man 2 on the PS5. Um... But yeah, no, Kirby, how are you doing? Alright, we got 38 rupees this time around. We only need 40. And there's our 40. <laughs> Yeah, we got the Deku shield back again. See you later, buddy. All right, let's go ahead and equip our Deku shield and save the game. See, chat, this is going to be way more tough because I can't make multiple save files. I can't just save the game and then revert back to another save like we did in Twilight Princess. Whatever, Mido. I'm Wonk. I'm the greatest adventurer of all time. Ba 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 ba. I don't recommend the E. I bought one new and it broke pretty quickly. I heard the slim models are more reliable. Um, there was like multiple slim models. There was the the slim model that replaced the actual like tactile button with touch. With like a touchpad, right? And I think those were the ones with the silver disc tray. And they came in black, blue, white, and I think another color. There was this one that looks like a Star Wars uh, console. Oh, Navi, thou hast returned. Lonk, welcome. Listen carefully to what I, the Deku Tree, am about to tell thee. Thy slumber these past moons must have been restless and full of nightmares. As the servants of the evil gain strength, a vile climate pervades the land and causes nightmares to those sensitive to it. Verily thou hast felt it. Lonk, the time has come to test thy courage. I have been cursed. I need to, you to break the curse with your wisdom and courage. My main Xbox 360 is the Star Wars one. Uh, it makes the R2-D2 noises when it turns on. Really? Yo, one of the uh, retro shops near me actually has one. I think they want like $130 for it. It's not bad. But I still feel like spending $130 for a 360 in 2024 is a bit steep. I think $80 to $90 should be worth what the 360 was worth. Because like it doesn't even come with the the expansion bay. Yeah, I got the complete in box with the Kinect in the games. Yo, speaking of the Kinect, uh, I need to buy the Xbox One Kinect if I can find it. I know it was a failed thing, so I don't know if it'll be worth anything later on, but 
I kind of want to collect the old OG Connect. And then I can do a playthrough of Dead Rising 3 where I can yell at my TV. Yo, what's going on, Good Talk? How are you? Uh, I want the box from the Star Wars model for display. It, it looked nice. Um, I don't know. That's kind of tough to find the original box. I swear, if this is a heart piece, I'm quitting this series right now. It's probably not. All right, we're good. I was about to say, I'm just going to quit stream. <laughs> No, I will not listen to you, Navi. Navi, you're, you are absolutely useless. All right, chat, let's speed run this. I have one. I actually use it for 3D modeling. Really? <laughs> it's a heart piece. Remember when Lay Monster used to live stream? I just quit streaming in general. I'm like, you know what, chat? It's been a good run. Ocarina of Time puts me into retirement. <laughs> nah, chat, we should be able to beat this fairly easy. We just did it like a minute ago. It only took us like 10, 15 minutes to do it. Hop across here. Welcome back, Renee. Thank you. We should be able to easily finish this though. But yeah, yo, Fishy! Yo, Fishy, guess what? We actually just failed this uh, run and I had to end stream and redo it again. I was stupid and I grabbed the, the heart piece. Yo, chat, check out Domestic Fishy. Can I get a, can I get a, a, a link for him, please? Bruh. <laughs> yeah, no, I was too busy reading chat and I and I walked forward and I picked up the heart piece. Yo, thanks, Triforce. Chat, go sub the fishy. He started doing YouTube shorts content now. He started doing uh hashtag short streams. I wonder, can I just like ignore you and just go up here? Aha! It does work. Pull out our Deku stick. Hit this. Hit this. But yeah, no, chat, we should be able to fight Goma here in a second. It shouldn't take us more than, like, what? Five, seven minutes? was really dumb. Uh, but we, you know what? We had it on the first go and then we just fell off again. Bruh. Chat, I feel like we're going to be taking a lot of L's today. We took a big L earlier and now we're taking little small L's. Yo, Fishy, uh, how was your uh, Smash Brothers stream, by the way? Why is gravity so evil? Exactly. 
It do be that way sometimes. You went crazy? Really? Um, so does that mean that your short stream went crazy and you gained a bunch of subs? Because if so, that's Pog. My actual pro Smash player showed up and added me and everything. Yo, for real? Let's go. Is this what, is this the, the domestic fishy pro arc? Is this where you get to become a, a Smash Pro streamer? Is that going to tournaments and making tons of money? There we go. Wait, I just bought a used DVD that had a massive sticker on it. And from the start of this stream till now, it, I've only just managed to remove it, so it took you 21 minutes to remove that sticker. Wow. Yeah, so I got purged, but I gained it all back again, organically again. Huh. Or did the YouTube system uh, check and validate those subscribers? And like the subscribers were actually valid people, so the YouTube system gave them back to you. Even then, I don't really think we'll ever truly know. So it went crazy. The hashtag shorts that does work. See, I told you. Bro, how long were you doing YouTube shorts for before you realized that you had to do the, the hashtag shorts hashtag? What's my favorite food? Um, I like all food. I'm not really picky when it comes to food, but I think if I had to pick, I like Philly cheesesteaks. Those are really good. No audio out at dinner. Have <laughs> a great stream, Broski. Yo, chat, go sub to Avery. I wonder, can I... How do I shout Avery out? Avery meets... World. I think I have an idea. I'm gonna go over to Twitch. Go to my channel. Go sub to Avery. And then while I'm at it, let me go over to the YouTube streams. There we go. Okay, cool. We're good. Uh, let's continue. Please forgive me, Master. I'll never do it again. If you spare me, I'll teach you something cool. Yeah, so it's two, three, one. OMG, what's going on, Papa? Uh, Papa, good thing that you're here. So we just finished this uh, this actual dungeon, right? I almost called it a temple, but um, 
I actually rolled and grabbed the heart piece and had to end stream because we failed the run already. So I'm doing it again. So that's why we're here again. So let's see if we can't finish this in less than 10 minutes. Bruh, stop capping. <laughs> Listen, I don't want chat knowing that I actually walked over and picked it up by accident while reading chat. That's embarrassing. <laughs> I was having to grab the hearts though. Yeah. I was I just randomly walked over to it and I accidentally picked up another heart and I was like should we just do a four heart challenge but no we can't do that the thumbnail has already been made it says three hearts so we have to honor it retitled three heart to <laughs> four heart challenge Uh, it's such an automatic for me to just OP Link at all times. Yeah. I mean, after this, we're pretty much done. So get down to where the Gomas are. Finish the 2 3 1. Oh, hold on. Oh. oh. There we go. I'll just take the hit. That's fine. You got away from him, that's all that matters. Get out of here. Hey, you better run. Let's go. Run, Link, run! Here we go. Save our Deku stick. Climb back in here. All right, chat. We have to light up that last area, push the block over, and get into where Goma is. Um, I guess if I was mindful, I could play Link with only three hearts. I've played this damn thing enough. Um, you should totally do it. See, the problem with me is I've played this game enough to know better not to open up to certain chests. But something tells me that we're going to end up failing this run because of the fact that... Oh, I did it again. Yeah, what's going on, six string? Uh, does not sound that hard? Well, we just ended up failing a minute ago. I walked towards the, the Goma heart and accidentally picked it up. Wait, no fairies, right? Um, I think we are allowed to have fairies. Fairies and potions are okay. Alright, what about milk? I think so, yeah. I think most health items are okay. As long as we don't use uh, any heart containers. So that's the goal. So fairies, milk, potions, they're all up for grabs. The only thing that's not up for grabs is the actual heart containers itself that increase your hearts. You must stay at three hearts at all times. Permadeath run? Bruh. Alright, Goma. You're done for. Alright, chat. <laughs> so hopefully we don't run over to the heart again. Oh, 
Come on, Goma. And it's over. Yo, what's going on, Oscar? How you doing today? Hope you're having a good Friday. All right, chat. Do not pick up the harpies. <laughs> See, chat, that's what happened. I was reading chat. I walked forward and picked it up. Don't forget to pick up the heart. No, <laughs> not again. Uh, I'm doing all right. Having a chill Friday. It's kind of cold and rainy today, so I thought about doing some some Zelda today. Well done, Long. Oh, but I thought you rolled. <laughs> Thou hast verily de demonstrated thy courage. I knew that wouldst be able to carry out my wishes. <clears throat> now, I have yet more to tell ye. Wouldst thou listen? No. Now listen carefully. A wicked man of the desert cast this dreadful curse upon me. You're good, Marie. So, Oscar, um... Are you a Zelda fan? And if so, what is your favorite Zelda? This evil man ceaselessly uses his vile sorceress powers in his search for the sacred realm that is connected to Hyrule. Water Temple is my favorite temple. I never raged once at it. Really? I don't know. I died like 50 times in that temple. That and Jabu Jabu. Uh, for it is in the sacred realm that one will find the divine relic, the Triforce which contains the essence of the gods. See chat, now we know why Triforce Hunters hunts the Triforce. Before time began, before spirits have ever existed, three golden goddesses descended upon the chaos that was Hyrule. Din, the goddess of power. Nehru, the goddess of wisdom. Feore, the goddess of courage. Why do they look like Grammys or Oscars? They look like little Oscar trophies. Din. With her strong flaming arms, she cultivated the land and created the red earth. Nehru. Poured her wisdom into, onto the earth and gave the spirit of law to the world. Fiore. With her rich soul produced all life forms and who would uphold the law. The three great goddesses, their labors completed, departed for the heavens. And golden sacred triangles remained the point of the world. Since then, the sacred triangles have become the basis of our world's providence. And the resting place of the triangles have become the sacred realm. Thou must never allow the desert man in black armor to lay his hands on the sacred Triforce. This is uh, Hyrule's final hope. Wow, that took so long, Link was literally taking a nap. Long, go now to the, to the Hyrule Castle.
you got the Gokiri's Emerald. This is a spiritual stone of the forest, now entrusted to you by the date by the Great Deco Tree. The future depends upon thee, Lonk, thou art courageous. Goodbye, Deku Tree. The animations for the how he dies is kind of crazy. Uh, let's go to Hyrule Castle, Lonk. Goodbye, Great Deku Tree. Little Birdie told me I got gifted a, a membership. Yeah, you got gifted a membership by Avery. So, do me a favor, Tropic, if you're not sub to him. Uh, his, we do explanation point, I think it's Avery. Yeah, no, Avery meets world. He, uh, he, he gave you a, a, a free sub. Look, what did you do? The great Deku tree, uh, did he die? How could you do a thing like that? It's all your fault. Yeah, but that's just how I've always called it, uh, six string. Yo, thank you so much, Yoshi. By the way, Yoshi, when he hits 750 uh, subs on YouTube, we're actually gonna do a Zelda collab. We're gonna collab on some Zelda. <laughs> so how's Fortnite, by the way? I seen you were playing Fortnite. Oh, you're leaving. It's all right. Let's go. <laughs> Oh, by the way, Papa, we're on the other stream, too, so if you want to come over to the other 1920 by 1080 stream, you can actually see the full game instead of just, like, the short side of it. I knew that you would leave the forest someday, Lonk, because you are different from me and my friends. But that's okay, because we'll be friends forever, won't we? I want you to have this ocarina. Please, take good care of it. Yoshi, we gotta play Fortnite at some point. Oh dang, no wonder. <laughs> yeah, no, it's, it's alright, Papa. You've received the Fairy Ocarina. This is a memento from Saria. Yo, me, you, and Keegan should hop into Fortnite sometime this weekend. When you play my Ocarina, I hope you will think of me and come back to the forest to visit. Oh, by the way, Papa, I see you, uh, you changed your profile picture to Navi, the fairy. Sorry, I gave you an instrument, so now Link pursues a career in water. <laughs> As a wandering bard. Yo, MVL. Can I get a... Can I do a video game request for your channel? I mean, you don't have to do it right now, but if you actually own the game, it'd be sick to see you play through it. I kind of want to see you do a playthrough of Fable. Fable 1 or Fable 2, but I would prefer Fable 2. Hey, listen. It appears that you... Have, uh, oh my gosh. It appears that the time has finally came for you to start your adventure. You love the Fables? I'm still waiting on that new Fable remake to come out. You will encounter many hardships ahead. That is your fate. Don't feel discouraged, even during the toughest of times. Go straight this way and you will see Hyrule Castle. You will meet a princess there. If you are lost and don't know which way to go, look at the map. There are areas that you have explored that will be shown on your map. On the map subscreen, you will also see a flashing dot showing you which way you should go next. I think I actually did Fable many, but many years ago. I've been meaning to stream Fable 2 for ages, played it before, but I've forgotten everything. 
All right, chat. <clears throat> it's time to go straight over to Hyrule Castle. We have to go wake up Mr. Mario outside of the back end of the castle. <laughs> Yo, chat, I really like the whole idea of playing through Fable 2 on stream. I might do a playthrough of Fable, chat. I don't know. I just don't know if you guys want to watch me play through that long game. The game is super duper long. There's not much voice acting in it, so it's mostly just me running around fighting enemies. It would be cool, because like I can get married in that game, have kids, start a family, go find all the demon doors, chase down pretty much all of the bandits and stuff that fight in all the towns. Okay, we gotta we gotta fight. Ow! Huh? 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 <laughs> What's up, crazy? Dive into the water? Oh yeah, you're right. Ha <laughs> ha, suckers. Ha <laughs> ha. Get wrecked. See chat, this is way more peaceful. Ah, serenity. All right, well, it's daytime now. They're gonna burn in about 2.1 seconds. Welcome to the marketplace, chat. If you're like, if you like reading dialogue, would you be interested in playing any Dan Gun Ranpa game? Let me Google that real quick. It's an anime series. Whoa, it's got this really cool like yin and yang like bear. Kinda reminds me of like Persona in a way. I'll have to check it out after stream then. No, it's Marin! <laughs> oh, it's solving murder mysteries. All right, chat, let's go grab ourselves a chicken. Hey, Log, this way. Goodbye, Mr. Owl. Okay, well, she's not out here. So I think we're supposed to go back out here and talk to Marin, yeah? And then she'll meet us back in the front? Or not, she's not there anymore. Oh, we just had to reload the area. Hey, your clothes, they're different. You're not from around here, are you? Oh, you're a fairy boy from the forest. My name's Malon. My dad owns the Lon Lon Ranch. Dad went to the castle to deliver some milk, and he hasn't come back yet. Figures. Figures! It's always the father leaving to go get the milk and never comes back. 
I can't believe Mario would do that to his daughter. Shame on Mario. <laughs> he left for the milk and never came back. Some milkman he is. <laughs> this is Mario's lazy alternative reality. Fry the egg! <laughs> Yo, Bushido! What's going on, man? How you doing today? Oh wait, are we supposed to take this chicken egg and put it in our inventory? I think we are. Exhausted, running on five hours of sleep? Dang. I didn't get up until like three o'clock, so I slept in. I knew it was Friday, so I was like, you know what, I'm sleeping in. That's why I have so much energy today. Alright, we gotta move these crates over and wait for this egg to hatch. Bushido, go get some sleep. Go back and take a nap. Go get like three more hours of sleep. Chat, it's kind of sucks that we can't just like... Because he's laying perfectly, right? If we just took this box and pushed Mario into the water, he would wake up. The water would literally wake him up. So now we just gotta run around for a minute until we can get up all of the, uh, the time for the egg. Talon has a Bowser zipper? I didn't even know that. That's super cool. Oh, uh, chat, have any of you guys played the Kinect version of the Legend, or Legend, the Kinect version of Fable? There was, like, this weird Fable game that came out after Fable 3, and it was, like, a Kinect-only game. It was so weird. Bro, depending on how relaxing or calming your commentary is, I might be taking a nap. Uh, we're actually gonna do a pretty chill stream today. I have it, and it's so awful, really. I don't even remember playing that game. I just remember it being really bad. Alright, where's that sun at? Oh, it's daytime almost. Come on. Yay! Our egg hatched. All right, Mario, wake up. What in the tarnation? Can a person get a little shut-eye around here? No, no, you cannot. Uh, let me see here. I have it, it's so awful. I'm gonna be working again on Monday. Oh, dude, then you, you need to get as much sleep as you can over this weekend. Get your body charged up and ready. So it's mostly trotting like a horse. It wasn't what I expected, really. Yep, I'm Talon, the owner of Lon Lon Ranch. I went to the castle to deliver some milk, but I sat down here to rest and I guess I fell asleep. What? Madeline was looking for me? I'm gonna catch it from her now. I messed up bad, leaving Madeline behind to wait for me. That's the lay monster. What's going on, Laywing? Long time no see, Lightwing. Yo, Lightwing. Um, we're also streaming over on YouTube as well. <laughs> Bushido talking about needing to take a nap is making me yawn. We're talking about uh, some of the old Xbox 360 games that we liked uh, over the years. And uh, I brought up about Fable, and I was like, has anybody here ever played the, the, the one Fable game that required the Xbox Connect? I remember that game being pretty horrible. 
You know what, chat? They could have totally kept on... Like, Lionhead Studios could have totally kept on making Fable games. But the fact that they stopped after Fable 3 because they, they said they ran out of time events in history, it's just kind of dumb. I don't know. Like, to me personally, it, it, it doesn't really make sense to me. Like, realistically speaking, they could have changed the storyline or redid it or remastered one of the older games and then worked from there onto the next one. They didn't have to just end the series right there. All right, chat, one of my least favorite parts. Let's see if we can speed run this. Oh, okay. Wait. Aha! Uh, well, there's new Fable in the way, yeah. They're, they're rebooting the game series finally after all these years. But I feel like it doesn't really make sense to keep rebooting the same Fable 1 uh, from Turn 10 Studios, so maybe they'll, they'll make another game, hopefully. Well, technically, they sort of already remastered Fable 1 for the anniversary release on Xbox 360. Yep. Don't get greedy, don't go for the rupees. Facts. They ran out of Fable juice. True. Um, well, there's a new Fable on the way. Yes, there is. Oh, chat. Um, I learned some stuff from my buddy Soupy. So apparently... I don't remember if it's this one. This one has all of the characters from Mario in it, in Metroid. That one dropped a rupee, but the one that I'm looking for is where... I think it's this one. If I hit this one right here, he'll throw a, a bomb at me. Yeah! Hey you! Don't cause any trouble! Wait, if I hit this one, what happens? Nothing. Okay. Give me one second here, chat. I'll catch up with you in, the, in a second after I'm done with this, uh, here. What? Who? Who are you? How did you get in, in past the guards? Oh, what's that? Is that... a fairy? Then are you... are you from the forest? Then... then... You wouldn't happen to have the spiritual stone of the forest, would you? That green and shining stone? Do you have it? Yes, I do. <laughs> Just as I thought. I had a dream. In the dream, dark storm clouds were billowing over the land of Hyrule. Uh, Lightwing, 3DS. But suddenly, a ray of light shot out of the forest, parted the clouds, and lit up the ground. The light turned into a shiny- or into a shiny figure. A figure holding a green and shining stone, followed by a fairy. I know this is a prophecy that someone would come from the forest. Yes, I thought you might be the one. Oh, I'm sorry. I got carried away with my story and didn't properly introduce myself. I am Zelda, Princess of Hyrule. You've never had a connect, Bushido? What is your name? Lonk. Strange. It sounds so somehow familiar. Okay then, Lonk. I'm gonna tell you the secret of the sacred realm that has been passed down by the royal family of Hyrule. Please, keep this a secret from everyone. N no <laughs> I'm telling everyone. The legend goes like this. The three goddesses hid the Triforce containing the power of the gods somewhere in Hyrule. The power to grant the wish of the one who holds the Triforce in his hands. If someone with a righteous heart makes a wish, it will lead Hyrule... Okay. If someone with an evil mind has 
his wish granted, the world will be continued. For the ancient sages built the Temple of Time to protect the Triforces from the evil ones. Um, I've got a Trimount, uh, which houses the Wii sensor, PS3, move camera, and connect at the same time on my TV, so I have no excuse not to play them. I've had this random uh, horror connect game called Rise of Nightmares I've been meaning to play for ages. I've never had a connect, really, Bushido? Uh, funny you named him Lonk. Zed did that too, really? I always named him Linky. So it's, it kind of looks like an actual name. Yeah. Well, I mean, remember, we named him Bonk in the Twilight Princess playthrough. Um, that's right. The Temple of Time is the entrance through which you can enter the sacred realm from our world. But the entrance is sealed with a stone wall called the Door of Time. And it is said to open the door, it is said that you need to collect the three spiritual stones. And another thing you need is the treasure that the royal family keeps along with this legend. The Ocarina of Time. Bonk and Papa John. That's great. I forgot to tell you. I was flying through this window just now. In the, in the other element from my dream, the dark clouds, I believe they symbolize that man in there. Will you look at him through the window? Can you see the man with the evil eyes? That is Ganondorf, the leader of the Gerudos. They hail from the desert far to the west. Though he swears allegiance, or allegiance to my father, I am sure he is not sincere. The dark clouds that covered Hyrule in my dream, they must symbolize that man. What happened? Did he see you? Don't worry. He doesn't have any idea what we're planning yet. Yes. I told my father about my dream. However, he didn't believe it was a prophecy. But I can sense that evil man's intentions. What Ganondorf is after must be nothing less than the Triforce of the Sacred Realm. He must have come to Hyrule to obtain it. And he wants to conquer Hyrule, no, the entire world. Lonk, now that we are the only ones who can protect Hyrule, please. Thank you. I, I am afraid I have a feeling that man is going to destroy Hyrule. He has such a terrifying power. But it's fortunate that you have come. We must not let Ganondorf get the Triforce. I will protect the Ocarina of Time with my power. He shall not have it. You go find the other two spiritual stones. Let's get the Triforce before Ganondorf does, and then defeat him. One more thing. Take this letter, and I'm sure it'll be helpful to you. You received Zelda's letter. I think we have to give that to the person at the gate. I believe. Yo, it's Sheik. I am Impa of the Sheikas. I am responsible for protecting Princess Zelda. Everything is exactly as the princess foretold. You are a courageous boy. You are heading out on a big new adventure, aren't you? My role in the princess's dream was to teach a melody to the one from the forest. This is by an ancient melody passed down by the royal family. I have played this song for Princess Zelda. It's a lullaby ever since she was a baby. Leo says hi. Uh, there is a mysterious power in these notes. Now listen carefully. Memorize this song. Bruh. Bruh. I did it right. The game's just being weird. There we go. 
But how are you, Lightwing? Hopefully, uh, hopefully your streams are going well. Do you still play PUBG with Brightside? You've learned Zelda's Lullaby. If the castle soldiers find you, there will be trouble. Let me lead you out of the castle. Okay then. <laughs> Thanks for the lurk, Papa. Appreciate you. Uh, take a mountain, or take a good look at that mountain. That is Death Mountain, home of the Gorons. They hold the spiritual stone of fire. At the foot of Death Mountain. You will find my village, Kakariko. Uh, that is where I was born and raised. You should talk to some of the villagers there before you go up to Death Mountain. This song I just taught you uh, has some mysterious power. Not only do the royal family members are allowed to learn this song. Huh. Alright. Yo, Sheik is literally a magician. <laughs> and the latest is we have... Is Lei failing to play the ocarina? I mean, chat, we've only been live for an hour. I feel like we've made pretty good progress so far. Wait, no! <laughs> we went the wrong way! Very true. Now, I think if we find all of these chickens, we'll get a bottle. So let's go find the other six chickens. Alright, uh, there's one up on the rooftop on the left hand side. There's one back here. There's one over there. Okay, I might actually have to use this chicken real fast to get the other chicken. All right, let's grab this chicken. Look at all those chickens. We'll throw this one. And this one. Ah, I've been throwing ch <laughs> chickens since the old Zelda days. Alright, so now we have a second chicken here. I think we need it to get up to the other side. Obviously, there's a chicken inside the box over here hiding. So that's the other one we need. Oh, there's one down there as well. Out in the distance. Wait, how do I get that chicken up there again? Oh no. I forgot how. <laughs> There's two chickens. Three scalpers <laughs> branded KFC. Those four chickens. Kakariko fried chicken. It's actually kind of dark when you think about it. Like, she just raises a bunch of chickens, and then just, like, fries them at the end of the day. Yo, 
Yeet. Come on, Link. No! Link, you had that! What if I climb on top of the box and then we jump off from here? Nope. Dang. Chat, I don't remember it being that hard to get across there. Am I missing something? Oh, that's why. Now we throw the chickens over. Okay. So we weren't supposed to clear that giant gate. We were supposed to come over here to the side. Oh, there's another chicken up on top. What? There's three chickens here. Wait, do we use the chicken up here to get to the rooftop to get to the other chicken? Can I get the party started? All right, Triforce. So I see you've started playing Fable now. Pick and Chaser. Yo, wait, that's an actual um mini game. Do you remember the there's like a chest in Fable 2? Where in one of the dungeons you had to go online to fable.com backslash chickens. And when you did that, it would take you to a, a portal where you had to play a mini game, and if you completed that mini game correctly, it would give you a code, and then you would type in that code into the game, and it would give you the chicken costume. What is that? Two, three, four. We need like two more. Oh, for real? I didn't even know that. Pick up the other uh, chicken. Look at all those chickens. Hey, chat, this is actually kind of making me want to go play Fable. And I believe all of the Fable games are actually on the Xbox Game Pass. I don't think I can get that funnel chicken until we have the hook shot, right? Or can I make the chicken mad by hitting it with the slingshot? Now I'm kind of curious. Hold on. Can we shoot the chicken on top with the slingshot and then make it mad so it, it falls off the edge and we can grab him? I don't think we can. Wait, that's the last chicken. 
right? Wait, that's all six chickens. The seventh one is up there, but we don't need that one until later on. Double check here. Yeah, we did it. Yeah! Let's go! <laughs> Save the game. GG! Show him the note from Zelda. Oh, this is, this is surely Princess Zelda's handwriting. Well, let's see. Okay, hmm. This is long. He is under my orders to save Hyrule. Wahahaha. <laughs> What kind of funny game has our princess come up with now? Okay, okay, all right. You can go now. Just be careful, Mr. Hero. <laughs> as soon as you leave and re-enter, she'll have lost the chickens again. Ah. Uh... Why would you ever become a chicken farmer when you have allergies to said chickens? That never made any sense to me. <laughs> Maybe it's the family business? True. She could have inherited all those chickens. Don't you do it, Mr. Goron? We can be friendly. Alright chat, I'm gonna leave you guys with this guy for a minute. I'm gonna go grab a glass of water and get up and stretch my legs for a minute. So I'm gonna zoom in on his face. And you guys can stare at a scratching Goron for the next minute and a half. <laughs> Alright chat, I'll be right back.
All right, I'm back. I had to brew some coffee. All right, chat. Let's continue. Hey, it's dangerous for a little kid like you to come out here. You might fall down. Made up a whole floor about your search for water. Yeah, I grabbed a glass of water and I was like, you know what? I can so go for coffee right now. He went to get a drink and possibly got lost when he back to his computer. I made some French vanilla coffee though. 
Uh, I'm trying to figure out what to do here. Do I just walk in through the door? No. Oh! I have to pull out the ocarina. Yo, what's going on, Garrett? Oops. Uh, chat, I don't know Saria's song, though. Oh, okay. Bruh. There we go. Yep, see, you got it. You got it, lady. Moved pretty well today, thanks for asking. I got a shiny uh, puppetar a couple hours ago. Yo, that's sick. I'm doing all right. Just chilling, made some coffee. And then after stream, I got some, uh, some stir fry cooking. So, I'm gonna eat some good foods after stream. Let's speak to the Mr. Goron. Uh, what the heck? Who are you? When I heard the song of the royal family, I expected their messenger had arrived, but you're just a little kid. Has Darunia, the big boss of the Gorons, really lost so much status to be treated like this? By his own sworn brother? The king? Yeah, it's stir-fry with honey sriracha. Uh, no, I'm really angry. Get out of my face, now! Are you asking why I'm in such a bad mood right now? Ancient creatures have infested the Dodongo's cavern. Now there's a rock shortage. Is MBL still in chat or did he leave? Well, that's not quite what I was looking for. Alright, um, you know what, chat, I wonder, can I do this without needing to actually learn the song? It'd be crazy if I can. Let me look up Saria. Saria. I have to have it learned before I can do it. I'm here for a bit, but I need to shoot off, so... Oh, it's 2 a.m. your time. Oh yeah, MVL, are you streaming tomorrow? Um, I haven't had the chance to play through Spider-Man 2 yet, so... I've been watching your playthrough. Oh, let's see... We gotta go, I think, this way? No, that's blocked off, but it does lead back to Saria. Wait, do I have to give him the note? And that's why, okay, hold on. Looks like this item doesn't work here, what? Bro, accept the note from Zelda. Okay, I guess we have to go back to the village then. So we came all this way for nothing. Yep, we have to go learn Saria's song. 
I wonder, am I gonna die if I jump off the cliff here? I think we will die. We're gonna give it a shot, though. <laughs> yep, okay. Note to self, don't do that. Yo, Elvis! How are you? Uh, glad to see you, lady. Just dropping in to say hello. Well, Garrett, uh, we're also live on the other stream, too, if you want to come over to the 1920 by 1080. That way you can see the full game rather than just, like, the, the edge of the actual game. Oh, thank you so much, Garrett. I appreciate you. Thank you so much for hanging out and stopping by. Always good to see you. Uh, you do know, uh, there's an entrance to the forest, but it's closed, uh, from the Goron uh, uh, Goron City Boulder. Yeah. That's why I'm going all the way back there right now, on foot. Would be pretty cool if we could have Epona right about now. Oh, by the way, Murray, did you know that there was supposed to be a light temple? Or I think it was either the light temple or the ice temple. Is what we were supposed to have in this game, but it, we never actually got it. I am. Okay, where is Saria at? Is she over here? No. Is she inside? Oh, I remember playing the GameCube version, and I had to get a guide to find all the heart pieces and stuff to 100% the game. Uh, the other time, I did only three hearts to up uh, no upgrade to have damage. Oh, I had to go to the Lost Woods! Mm-hmm-hmm-hmm. <laughs> Wait, Lay, what's your epic username? Uh, it should just be Lay Monster. If not Lay Monster, it should be Lay Monster 01. If not, I'll just have to uh, go on my epic and find it and I'll give it to you on Discord. Can I climb up from here? There should be vines here, right? Yeah. Mm hmm. After this, I, rem I recommend getting the Sun Song. Okay. Now, I believe I remember how to do this correctly the last time. You go to the right. Oh, no, not you. Long, good to see you again. You could have gotten the Lost uh, Woods from Goron Village. Really? The annoying, the annoying owl? Yes. I hate how he always tricks you. With the yes and no. Because because the game already knew that you weren't going to read every single thing that he said to begin with. Alright, it's the first one up here. Wait, uh, yes, the forest meadow. I hate these wolves so much. Ow. 
Get wrecked, good sir. <laughs> also, chat, I was gonna race Avery in Ocarina of Time, but the sad part is, is that I wanted to do a three heart challenge, so I just didn't do it. It's okay, we'll just race him in another game when, when, the, when the time comes. Really? Uh, bruh, you could have got. That's what I've been saying to Lady. True. I didn't think you could go through it though without needing the actual um, the bombs. Oh no, we're gonna die! Ah! No, we have a quarter heart. Whoa! Does that scare them away? I've been waiting for you, Long. This is the sacred forest meadow. It, it's my secret place. I feel this place will be very important for the both of us someday. That is what I feel. If you play the ocarina here, you can talk with the spirits in the forest. Would you like to play the ocarina with me? Sure, let's do it. Oh, yeah, no, you do. Lonk! <laughs> Fun fact, chat. When I was younger, the first song I ever learned on the piano was Saria's song. And then I learned the song of time. Ocarina of Time songs are just really fun to play on piano. Uh, you've learned Saria's song. Yay, the beeping is back. I'm sorry, that was kind of funny. Now you could hear it. Fuse it out here. You serious? Running for me. Thank you. Ooh, let's not do that. There was a fairy nearby. Is it down here? Fairy. Heal me, fairies. Get rid of all the problems that I'm having. And while we're at it, let me capture one of you in a bottle.
Wait, is there nothing that I get out of this? It's just fairies? There's like no fairy lady that's gonna like come out of here and like give me a bigger wallet or bless my character at all? Nothing? Hey. It's just, wait. Listen. Well, yeah. <laughs> no, duh. Navi. Navi's like, go to Death Mountain. I'm just like, bruh. Oh, it's just a normal fairy fountain? Gotcha. Just us running all the way back. <clears throat> Hoo -hoo. You learned the Ocarina song from Saria? The melody seems to have some kind of mysterious power. <clears throat> I should be able to just like walk through any of these, right? When in a situational battle, always pick up an emergency fairy? Very true. Not the owl again. Bro, he's everywhere. Now no fun beeping sound? Yeah. All right, now we just have to roll our way all the way back. Hi. Welcome on in, Miriam. How are you doing today? Hope you're having a good Friday. Hello from the Twitch side. What's going on, Garrett? Welcome on over. Now you can see the game in the full 1920 by 1080. Full 1080 HD. Kakriko Village. Call you Zoe. All right. Looks right, right? Looks way better on 1920 by 1080 than it does on mobile. <clears throat> Alright, well, we're slowly making our way back. I want to laugh if the owl appears again? I think he will. No, that's that's Slink in a nutshell. Uh oh, no, you don't. The Goron was coming straight for us. Mr. Goron, I'm home. Mr. Goron, are you home? You are. Is Goron trying to play the Link bowling game? Yeah. Zoe, if you click on my profile and you go to the second stream, you'll find a full 1920 by 1080 stream with filled with other people. The short stream is just kind of like 
dead right now. There's not really too many people in it. But if you come over to the other stream where everybody else is, you can actually watch the game in a much larger uh, form factor. What a hot beat! Whoa! Yeah! Yahoo! Dot com. Hey, what a nice tune! Just like that, my depression is all gone! Something just came over me! I suddenly wanted to dance like crazy! Yeah, we have to go on bracelet, let's go! Alright chat, let's go take on Dodongo's Cavern! Majestic dancing! Oh, by the way, chat, if you haven't already, go give MVL a, a follow, please. He makes great content. And since he'll be leaving here soon, go give him a sub. Alright, now we can actually open up this area. Run! Hey, I wonder if we can use one of these bomb flowers and run it all the way over to the other side. Well, it's kind of good that there's aren't many people here because I want the streamers to reply to your message. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> um. Oh, okay, I got you. You know, that makes sense. Back on the YouTube side for now? Alright. Yeah, I apologize, Garrett. Over on Twitch, uh, there's like six minutes or three minutes of ads every hour. There we go. Open up the shop, but we wasted a heart. That's fine. <clears throat> oh wait, he won't, uh, he won't buy to us because, uh, we're not Adult Link yet. I mean, we can buy hearts, but they're like overly expensive hearts. It's all good. It happens. Maybe Twitch just wanted to put ads on. Yeah. I mean, he's probably loose. Uh, lost his shop license. If he sold, it's very true. Wait, did these come back? What the? Why do they respawn? They're not supposed to re uh, respawn like that. That was weird. Alright, now I think we have to go all the way back up to the top of Death Mountain and throw a bomb flower. Yeah, that's what I was saying. That's weird. They're not supposed to just respawn with the boulders like that. <laughs> Alright, so we should be able to just grab a bomb flower over here and just yeet it over the edge. Yeet! Is that gonna work? Yeah! Let's go! Oh, it's 6 a.m. Ooh, okay. I was worried we were gonna die. That was a pretty big fall that Link just took. Alright chat, how long do you think it'll take for us to finish Dodongo's Cavern? It shouldn't take us that long, right? Like, realistically speaking? Oh. Rolling after a huge fall is a lifesaver? Very true. No, Navi, I don't want to listen to you. And... 
There we go. Get wrecked. <clears throat> Run over here, drop it, and roll out. There we go. Yo. You need to get some rest. Ow. Oh wait, I actually have to push this over, right? Yeah, I do. I mean, realistically, chat, I could see us beating this in like 30 minutes or less. Marie, how long, did, how long do you think it'll take for us to beat this? I would say no less than 30 minutes, right? Oh, no, not the Lazalfos. No! <clears throat> I hate these guys so much! You're doing the same thing for a month? Oh, then you're probably used to it by now, then. You're so good at hitting me. Stop. No, I have a fairy though. Aha, get reckless, Alpha. <clears throat> no death today. Now you're done for. Yeah, get wrecked. Come at me, bruh. Come on. Come on. Come at me. What? How did you hit me? I have my shield out. Revive. So, uh, Zoe, what kind of games do you play? Or what kind of games do you like to play? so close to a game over Link said not today buddy not today Yo Geometry Drash is pretty cool I used to play Roblox when I was a kid like years ago like back when Roblox first came out Okay, so note the stuff. I can't destroy these guys. So instead, we're just gonna run right past them. Wait, I don't think I can run past these guys, can I? I think I have to fight them. Okay, I don't have to fight them? Do I know Jojo Siwa? Um, isn't that like a YouTuber from like 2016, 2017? Like the next torch, come on. There we go. Hop on top of this switch here. We should raise, there we go, that door crossed. Perfect timing, don't fall in the lava. Oh, gotcha.
Cool, we got the map and not a heart because that would suck. <laughs> that would suck. If we just had to end the run right here again. Alright, dude. Gotta catch you later. Hope to see you uh, some game over count next time. Alright, MVL. Thank you so much for hanging out, man. I appreciate you. <laughs> Three hearts is just a tester? Yeah. <laughs> Big lurking, my dude. Now nah, you're good, uh, Papa. Thank you so much for lurking. Appreciate you. That was weird. Why did battle music start for 0 0.1 seconds? Wait. Wait, uh, Papa, do you do you stream or make content on YouTube? <clears throat> no. Oh, uh, you're good, Marie. Oh, you don't. All right, chat, so... Okay, we need to get up here real quick. No! Oh! Yo, that was close. Is that a gold scatula? It is. Nice. All right, we'll drop down. Go into this room now. We should be getting close to the final boss now, right? All right, bye, Zoe. Thank you so much for hanging out. Appreciate you. Okay, that angered that one. <clears throat> oh no, my shield, what? My shield burned. No. Jeffrey, how you doing? Okay, so all of these guys come to life. Ow! Yo, what's going on, little JQ? Uh, it's so dissatisfying to leave the heart containers at the end of the dungeon. It is. <clears throat> but it's, you know, it's something we gotta do, though. We just finished doing a Twilight Princess 3 heart run, so now we're doing an Ocarina of Time one, and I feel like I'm gonna die a whole bunch on this one. Please drop a heart piece. No! Oh, no! Well, we might be dead here, chat. Oh, no. Get away from me. Get away from me, Keys! I don't want to die. <laughs> but yo, Jeffrey, uh, little JQ, how are you guys doing tonight? Hopefully you guys are having a good weekend. Wait a minute. Oh, uh, I forgot about this. Mistakes were made. If we don't get a heart piece, or I mean a heart container, we are going to die. For sure. No, no. <laughs> no. Uh, I forgot about that rock being there. Okay, I see what we need to do. Oh, okay. I see what we need to do. Okay, so we need to jump from platform to platform. 
Oh, wait, how do I get over there, though? Can I go around? No. Ah, there's other ones here, though. Please give me a heart piece. No! Well, that sucks. And I can't climb onto this either, can I? Oh, wait, I can grab this, though. Thank you. I don't have to listen to beeping the entire time. Uh, I speedrun Ocarina of Time, and I only died one time to Death Mountain since I didn't get the tunic. Oh. Yeah, I gotta remember to get the tunic. <laughs> Yeet. Oh, wait, I forgot about that. Okay, that was dumb. We, gotta we have to wait, like, two seconds before it explodes. Pick this up, wait for it. Ye no! No, Link! No! Really? Come on, man! Why are you gonna do me like that? Link, we were a team! Alright, well, we have to wait like 10 years for this. I'm so scared of dying now. Well, that's good that you're doing good, Jeffrey. Come on. Link! Seriously? We're gonna die because Link is being stupid. You got Link between worlds today? Let's go! Have you had a chance to play it yet? Why can't I just, like, lodge the the bomb into the corner of it? Yo, quick! Bro. Oh, you gotta go? Alright, little JQ, thank you so much for coming by, I appreciate you. We'll be live again tomorrow with more, uh, Three Heart Challenge. Bro! Are you get back onto the stream when, when you're home? Okay. Yo, quick, welcome to four hours of beeping. <laughs> well, there's your first death chat! We died to bomb flowers because Link is too stupid to throw them. Would you like to save? Yes. <laughs> the beeping is so grueling. All right, let me pull up the death counter. Here we go. Our first death today, chat. It only took two hours and ten minutes to get our first death. Continue playing? Absolutely. We've got to finish this temple. Oh, wait, no, this isn't a temple. This is a dungeon. But thankfully, like, most of it has already been pretty much finished. The endless peeping. It was non-stop for me with, with Minish Cap, really. That's one of the games I still need to finish, is Minish Cap. <clears throat> Alright, now we have to run all the way back. Minish Cap is actually so fun. Chat, I think I'm gonna play through Minish Cap once we finish Link's Awakening. I have to finish Link's Awakening. So I think tomorrow's stream will be some Link's Awakening. 
I would do four streams a day or two streams a day chat, but it's really uh, draining. I'm going to keep it real with you. It's very draining to do two different streams. When I was doing Breath of the Wild, it was super draining. <laughs> I should. <laughs> when we play Majora's Mask, I should name it Honk. So much Zelda! Very true. See, chat, Keegan calls himself a Zelda streamer, but I am the true Zelda streamer. I am the real Zelda tuber. <laughs> Egan is just my clone. <laughs> Though I thought about naming um, Ocarina of Time Link like Lonky or something. Welcome back, Marie. We died. Uh, you were the video game boy. You're the one who wins. Finally! Thank you! Get me out of here. Uh, how did you die? I died because Link would not throw the bomb flower correctly and he kept dropping it instead of throwing it and then I died. Oh great, more of you guys. I don't have a shield! Hey, you better run. Link, get up there! Link! Wait, why am I even fighting you guys? Seriously? No! 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 Bro, get out of here. Chat, I hate all those alphos. That's such BS, chat. All that work for nothing. <clears throat> I love how this game treats me. Well, chat, at least you guys get to see a little bit of insight on how this entire playthrough is going to go. To me, just dying to the most random things ever. <clears throat> uh, you don't have your soundboard, right? No, I don't. My computer lagged, like, a ton. Uh, like, right now, CPU percentage is 14% in OBS. And if I use the soundboard with the, with the actual death counter, it would use, like, 40% of my CPU. I don't know why Stream Deck uses so much, but it does. I also hate the fact that we have to do all this backtracking to get back to where we were. <laughs> and we got hit too, that's not cool. I'm up. Actually, like, set up to fail stream? True. So, uh, Lady Papa, do you eventually plan to become a content creator and start streaming and stuff, or...?
work? Wait, Deku Six do more damage. Yeah! Yeah! I forgot! The Deku Six do like 2.1% more damage. Your sword is weak at the moment? Yeah. Is this the right door we have to go through? No. Wait. Maybe. Is this the one? No. Um... Can't hear that door, it's the other one? Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Now we can finally shut up the beeping. That beeping is so annoying! Wait, I wonder, can we come back and leave and reset the the items in this room? Do they reset? Do I leave and then come back? Can I for, uh, farm hearts? Yes! Oh, but they don't actually give you an item. Uh, chat, what do I do? I'm all out of the, uh, the seeds. I can't get over there. I can't hit the eye. Yeah, that's a problem. Go where there's grass. Uh, leave. That's on the bridge. There should be grass. Okay. Ah, there we go. Just don't waste too many of them. Um, scream loudly and do exactly what the other two consistent chatters say. No. Uh, you should have it up now? Yeah. As long as I don't miss my shots, we should be fine.
Uh, I don't know if you saw my earlier comments, but I answered your question. Everyone knows I don't like Pokemon. Really? Wait, why don't you like Pokemon? Uh, let me see. But everyone was asking me, so I said if I had 10k subs. Oh, um, I don't want the anxiety that comes from it, but everyone has asked me, so I said if I had 10,000 subscribers, I would stream a game franchise I've never played, which is Pokemon. Really? And everyone knows I don't like Pokemon. Interesting. Here we go, turn-based battles. Yeah. Imagine I just missed that shot. I would be so salty right now. Activate that. Let's go. Uh, with that switch on, the moving platform can go higher now that you can re quickly reach the second floor. You know what's crazy, chat? I, you, I actually never could beat Dodongo's Cavern as a kid. I never understood how to do it properly. Uh, Pokemon just isn't my thing. Although I've seen all the streamers play it. Yo, if you play any Pokemon game, you should play Gale of Darkness. It's uh, from the GameCube. But the OG ones are pretty fun too. And also Sword and Shield is really good. So if you're looking for a game that you'd like, you're doing good now? Yeah. Yeet! Ooh, that could have been real bad. Wait, so chat, do I do I grab this, this bomb flower and then jump over? How does this work? No! Oh no, 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 no. Well, ladies, uh, that's what I was thinking. I would play the very first game. Oh, geez, the very first game? Ugh, that's, oh, geez. I don't know if you want to play Pokemon Red and Blue. Those games' graphics are not the best. If you ask me, I suggest playing the remake of Red and Blue, which is Fire Red. I mean, it's definitely not like a 32-bit or 64-bit game. It's still going to be like 8-bit, but it'll be a lot better of an experience. Bro, are you serious right now? Uh, I might need some help here, chat. What am I supposed to do? Because I don't have, like, a, a bomb bag, so I can't just, like, carry bombs to the second floor. I believe so? I might have to double check. But at least you get to pick. You get to pick, you know, fire red, leaf green, or you can pick another one. Get the bomb bag. Wait, do I have to get the bomb bag? Oh, is that what that chest was back there? That big chest that I walked past? Oh, no way. Oh, no. Oh, no. Bomb bag? Please be bomb bag. Okay. <laughs> it's just it just ends up being a heart piece and I have to end this the stream again. That would suck. Save the game. Wait, what? We're on top of him. Yo! 
<laughs> Wait. Huh? You know what? We're not going to question it, chat. Oh, there are no heart piece in this dungeon. Oh, so I've just been dodging all the chests for no reason at all. There we go. Now he should drop his mouth and we can drop in from there. Uh, texturing things that don't need to be textured is the last thing I expected. You might have to leave and come back here. Because, uh, we don't have any hearts. <clears throat> yeah, there's no hearts here, so we need to leave real quick. We'll come right back. There we go. Also save. Duly noted. Wait, chat. I'm gonna go... Take a one minute break. So, you're gonna get another Goron scratching his armpit again. I'll be right back. Give me one minute. Alright, I'm back. Yo, his eyes are piercing into my soul. What is going on with this Goron right now? Talk about creepy. Oh. Bye, Papa. Thank you so much for hanging out. I appreciate you. I remember when I first completed this dungeon thinking the game was almost over for real. That's crazy. Bruh. Get over here. You're wrecked. Oh, not gonna be here long, but hey. Hey, Navi. Oh, welcome on in, Grambo. How you doing? Hopefully your uh, Friday's going well. Oh, I forgot about this. It's pressure weighted. I think this right here should take us here? Through here? Yeah. Yeah, no, it's through here. And this takes us back into here. I'm over top of this rock, and then... Oh, wait a minute. 
I think we're supposed to grab this rock here. Pretty good. Haven't been doing much. Uh, Grandpa, we just finished the Twilight Princess HD playthrough. So now we're taking on Ocarina of Time. Oh, wait, how do we... Oh, okay, I see. So this puzzle is basically just pulling this block all the way over here, grabbing the other block and dragging it over. It seems simple enough. <clears throat> Grab this block, drag it over here. Okay, that block is still off center. Drag it over one more. Now drag it forward. Wait, how is that still off-centered? Oh, no matter how we do it, it's going to be off-centered. To the fairy! Wait, can we still do it? No, he didn't! Dang! Rip! <laughs> I love how Marie says that 2.1 seconds after I destroyed the pot. fact about me, I've never played a Zelda game past, like, the first hour. Really? Grandbo, you need to play the other Zelda games past the hour. They get way better once you get out of the tutorial. Uh, open world games just aren't for me. This isn't really an open world game, though. But I get what you're, I get what you're saying. You're seeing like adventure games in general just aren't your like your thing. Ah! All right, Mr. Dodongo. Here he is! King Dodongo! The infernal dinosaur! Wait, hold on, he's a dinosaur? Here. Wait, chat, how do I destroy Dodongo again? I have to throw a, a bomb flower at him, right? Yeah, I throw it into his mouth. 3DS. Uh, Grambo. How did that not work? No, 
was I was gonna die? What? Please be the last one and he just dies. Nope, doesn't seem that way. I'm so dumb for that. GG chat, GG. Yo, oh, Lil J. Lil JQ, welcome back. We just finished this boss battle with a quarter heart. link between worlds right now let's go how are you liking it so far <laughs> he's the one who takes my last quarter heart away i just die immediately it's me daruna well done thanks to you we can once again eat the delicious rocks from our dodongo's cavern until our stomachs burst rock roast it's pretty fun. Let's go. Uh, what's a wild adventure? It will make an incredible story. I can't believe the Dodongos suddenly appeared in such great numbers. And that big rock blocking the cave. All this trouble must have been caused by that Gerudo thief, Ganondorf. He said, give me the spiritual stone. Only then will I open the cave for you. You, on the other hand, risk your life for us. Kid, I like you. How about you and I become sworn brothers? Okay, Hulk Hogan. No, there's no big ceremony involved. Just take this as a token of our friendship. No rock roast? <laughs> Yo, thank you so much for the hug, Renee. The death hug. Wait, is that one of eight or one of six stones that we need? Oh wait, no, it goes, there's three or four stones, and then there's like four medallions that we need to get. One of the, each of the sages. You obtained the Goron Ruby. Brother, you'll keep brushing up on your skills as we travel, won't you? You should go see the great fairy on the top of Death Mountain. She will power you up. Yo, we could really use that upgrade. Link really said, nah, I'm out. <laughs> You did great! How about a big Goron hug, brother? <laughs> Link's like, I'm out! I don't want it! Oh great, the peeping is back. Uh, yeah, let's not die to that thing. Let's grab one of these. There we go. 
<laughs> the skull emojis. All right, Grandpa, thanks so much for hanging out, man. I appreciate you. Thanks for stopping by. My final words, beep, 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 beep. Oh no, not again. What? Oh, you're good. Uh, we need more bomb flowers now. Wait, chat, does the guy from the Goron place give me them or no? Or can I get them out of these? Oh, that is a lot of hearts. Sir, can I buy some of these? Oh wait, we don't want to go this way. We need to leave this area and go see the, the fairy fountain for the upgrades. And then I think the next one is Jabu Jabu's belly, right, chat? You go see the Zoras. And go get the stone of water. From, uh, the Zora princess. Throw them! Thank you! I don't know why it, it tried killing me so many times. Is there a cow here, chat? You can get milk from the cow by playing opponent. Oh. Okay, isn't the fairy down here? So 
it's up here then? If you go back into town again, get the Hylian shield. All right. No! I knew I should have taken down that last one. Here we go. I mean, realistically, chat, I think we could probably beat this game in about 15 hours. Don't you do it. No! That Skatula is going to be the end of me, I swear. Boing, boing. <laughs> I love how it gives me the exact current time. Get out our Fury Ocarina. That wasn't right. Wait, it's Zelda's Lullaby? Oh, left, up, right. Okay, so I had it backwards. I kept doing left, down, right, left, down, right, instead of left, up, right, left, up, right. There we go, time for the most creepiest fairies of all. The Ocarina of Time ones. Creepy! <laughs> Welcome, Wonk! I am the Great Fairy of Power. I'm gonna grant you a sword technique. Receive it now. Uh, you've mastered the secret sword technique of the spin attack. Wait, is this when we unlock the magic meter? Ah, oh, we did. Okay, now we have a magic meter. That'll come in handy. Now we can do the powered spin attack. Oh, I'm kind of surprised the owl hasn't talked to me yet. <laughs> oh, wow, half a heart. That's wild. Thankfully, there's a whole bunch down here. Uh, you can get a ride from him back to town. Oh, or not. <laughs> well then. No, Navi, I don't want to hear it. 
I don't want to hear anything from you, Navi. Navi, you're useless. Alright, that's our third gold Skatula. I think we need five or ten to get the, um... The upgrade for our bag. Wait, is this the lady who has the shop, the potion shop? It is. Ah, so that's the carpenter's house, huh? I didn't know the carpenter lived in Kakariko. Yep, that's what I'm doing right now. Going straight to the uh, the graveyard. Now, I think it's just as simple as moving the one stone over, right? <clears throat> Welcome to the graveyard. Yeah, I think we go all the way up to the top. We play Zelda's Lullaby. We break this stone in half. And then we go all the way down there where all the re-deads are. Here we go. Oh yeah, chat, we need to do Dampy as well. Do I have any shots? I do, I have one single one. There we go. Cool. Oh, wait. Where's the fire at? Wait, there's still one more enemy, isn't there? There is. over here. Ah! What? Ah! Wow, that must be one overpowered bat, chat. Finally, dang. This game's mechanics get kind of weird. Like the most simplest of things turn out to be really difficult for no reason. Oh wait, we need to get a stick, right? And light it on fire? No. No, it just opens. You have returned. Welcome back, cars. Let's try not to get grabbed by any of these. Yee. No thank you, good sir. Or, actually, you're not really a good sir at all. You're a bad sir.
You've already passed where you're at? Wait, it's not working. Check. Home is dedicated to the memory of the dearly departed members of the royal family. A rising sun will eventually set a newborn's life will fade. There we go. Stick, we learned the sun song. Let's go. All right, chat. Now we need to go back in the town and get ourselves the Hyrule shield. And maybe also get ourselves our Deku shield back too. Am I the only one who ever got creeped out by the Redeads as a kid? The Redead? I feel like the Redeads in Majora's Mask are like way worse though. Yo, what's going on, Dragonite? How you doing? Hope you're doing well today. How's your Friday going? We are taking on the Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time 3 Heart Challenge. And we just learned the Sun Song, which is perfect timing. Now we're gonna head back into Hyrule Town, or Castle Town rather, and um, get our shields back because mine burned in the last dungeon we just, we just went to. It's going. Uh, mine's going all right. Just kind of chilling, playing some Zelda. I don't remember. No, there's no shops here, right? There's no shops in Kakariko, so we have to go straight to. We have to go straight to actual Castle Town. Oh, cool, we got a magic jar. Let's go. No, I don't want to talk to the boss of the carpenters. Leave me alone. Leave Link alone. So, Dragonite, uh, I can see that your name is Dragonite, so you obviously like Pokemon. Um, what's your favorite Pokemon game? Or, like, what's your favorite Pokemon generation? My favorite will always be Gen 3 and Gen 4. I liked Heart Gold and Soul Silver. I liked Pokemon Platinum and Diamond and Pearl a lot. Those are like my, my go-to games. But then again, Fire, uh, yeah, no, Fire Red will always have a place in my heart as well. I've always liked Pokemon. Uh, I mean, my fave gen is four. But Gen 7 was your first game. Oh. Oh, wait, what was Gen 7? Uh, Gen 7 must have been... Oh, jeez, was it X and Y? Or was it Sun and Moon? I think Gen 7 was definitely on the 3DS, right? Sun and Moon. Okay, cool. Yo, chat, we should play Sun and Moon. We need Sun and Moon remakes. Nintendo, if you're listening, we need Sun and Moon remakes. Welcome! 80 rupees? Good thing we have 99. Ba 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 ba. While we're at it, let's grab. Oh, <laughs> we're broke. He wants 35 rupees for five uh, bomb flowers. Yeah, the 3DS. I actually, uh, I think I played Omega Ruby. Uh, that was like the one that my 3DS came with, was Omega Ruby. And then I eventually got X and Y. I didn't really, you know what's crazy? I actually am a huge Pokemon fan, but I fell out of love with the game when I grew up. And that sucks, chat. When you eventually grow up to that certain age to where you no longer find Pokemon enjoyable, it sucks. 
I kind of want to force myself to get back into Pokemon again. Because, like, the games I grew up with was, like, Fire Red all the way up to, like, Black and White. I never, you know, I never finished Black and White. I really should go back and play through them again. I just don't want to do too much Pokemon content on YouTube, though, either. I actually haven't. I bought Scarlet and Violet, but it's still in the case. I never actually popped it into my Switch yet. I have Sword. I actually played about an hour and a half with the Sword and never finished it. <clears throat> I know Sword is really good, though. Yeet. <laughs> uh, have you played the Mario and Luigi games? Uh, which ones? Because like, I'm gonna be real with you, the last Mario game that I like personally have played. Have you streamed Sword? I have. I played about an hour and a half of it, and then I got copyright claimed, and I had to delete it <clears throat> because at the time I was using copyrighted starting soon music for my streams. And I guess the YouTube thingy flagged it, and it ended up blocking it in all countries. So I had to delete the VOD. Um, I do want to replay through it again. I, I got up to, like, the first gym, and then I stopped playing Sword. So chat, at some point, I need to I need to get back into that. We're kind of doing our Zelda thing right now, though. We have to finish Link's Awakening and a couple other games in that. I had to prepare for Thousand Year Door. I know, it's sad. Um, but thankfully, I don't use that music in my starting soon anymore, so... In terms of Pokemon, I should do a sword playthrough. Uh, have you played the Mario and Luigi games? Uh, which ones? The games that I finished is, is uh, Sunshine 64. I never finished Galaxy 1 and 2. I think realistically, the last Mario game that I finished was Super Mario Brothers on the Wii. Like, the one that came with the Wii. Honestly, chat, I think by the end of this year, I want to be able to finish most of the Zelda games and start get, getting started on Sonic and Mario. And Pokemon. I want to start incorporating less Zelda content. <laughs> I lose all my subscribers. <laughs> Everybody just unsubs. Oh, you suck, Lee Monster. No more Zelda content? I'm out. <laughs> that is not what I subscribe to you for. But yeah, no, uh, Yoshi, what, what Mario and Luigi games are you talking about? Oh, hey, I'm on the normal one now. Welcome on over, Dragonite. The lighting is so good, low-key. If your favorite uh, generation is seven, right? What was your favorite Pokemon from Sun and Moon? Because I, I actually never played uh, Sun and Moon before. I own the cartridges, I just never played it. Yo, what's going on, little bro? Uh, Link versus Danny Phantom. Who's winning? I don't know. That's a good question. Does Danny Phantom have all of his powers? Favorite generation is either 7 or 4, but my favorite Pokemon from Gen 7 is Solgaleo? 
So if Danny Phantom has his powers, I don't know. That's a tough one. I mean, technically, Link also has the, the Triforce of Courage. So, like, it's kind of fair game, right? Hoo-hoo! Looks like you've gotten bigger and stronger already, Long. Bro, he just made me drop my bomb flower. I think mine has to be Pokemon Platinum, so like Gen 4. Gen 4 or Gen 5? Chomp, chomp, chomp. How about some magic beans? They aren't selling very well. 10 rupees. That's a steal. Alright, so we gotta grab our magic bean. Plant the magic bean. And I think we just have to wait for it to grow, right? I was talking about uh, the Mario Luigi RPG series. I don't... Oh, you're talking about... Um, oh, jeez. What was it called? Super Mario RPG, yeah? I don't remember Luigi ever having an RPG series. I know about the Super Mario RPG. Chat, we really do need a Heart Gold and Soul Silver remake. I just hope that they don't ruin it like they did uh, Diamond and Pearl. Also, Dragonite, have you played the Diamond and Pearl remake? I'm curious to know like, what your opinion is on it. Because, like, I'm an OG Pokemon player, right? I want to play through Pokemon Platinum again, but they never remade it. I own my Pokemon Platinum cartridge, I just can't stream it. So, like, my best bet when it comes to playing those games is through... the remake, sadly. So it's like, Diamond on the Switch was meh? Yeah, I heard that the whole Pokédex thing was, like, really weird. Who's that 8-bit idol right next to... Huh? What do you what do you mean, uh, little bro? Who's that eight bit idol right next to your also your idol hair grow? Huh? My favorite Pokemon is all forms of Diglett. I know Diglett is weak, but he's so cool. Midna? Oh, you're talking about Midna. I think. I think you're talking about Midna. Yo, chat, we get to go meet the, the king of the Zoras. He can go meet, meet, meet. <laughs> I hated that so much about the king, though. The king of the Zoras was so weird. Ditto, the mother and father of all Pokemon. Is it? I know the creator is Arceus. Although, chat, my favorite Pokemon of all time is Garatina. Although, when I was a kid, I used to be really into Mewtwo. Mew and Mewtwo. And Celebi. Oh, my dear sweet princess, Rudo! 
Where is she gone? I'm so worried. Meat. Meat. Uh, that character on top of your screen. Yo, what's going on, Gogeta? Wait, yo, wait, hold on. You're a Dragon Ball fan, right? Because I you have go you have Gogeta in your in your name, right? So my question to you is Who's your favorite Dragon Ball character? Uh once you get a six IV Ditto, it's the best option for breeding competitive Pokemon. Really? See chat, I really need to get back into Pokemon again. It's been way too long. I mean, I've always liked Master Roshi, but Krillin is like a really cool character too. Goku? Makes sense. Can we move him over? Sir, can you please move out of my way? Wait chat, I just realized the game. What happened to the game here? Hold on. There we go. Now you guys can see all of the icons. I don't know what happened to the game or why I did that, but okay. I don't know why it chose to zoom in like that. There we go. <laughs> now you guys can see the full game. It doesn't look all stretched out anymore. Um, so once you guys get a six IV ditto, it's like the best option for breeding competitive Pokemon. Wait, I didn't even know that there was even a thing that you can actually like breed competitive Pokemon. That's kind of cool. Um, I don't think we can talk to him right now. Where does this take me to? Oh, this is for the diving. Oh, wait a minute. Don't we get the, the ability to be able to breathe better? Yeah, we need to finish that game mode real quick. We need to dive. Do the diving and get the piece. Or Master Yui? No, I'm broke. <laughs> I couldn't afford it. Oh wait, yeah, no, this is for the quest. We have to get the the piece that allows us to breathe underwater or dive further. So that way we can get the message in the bottle saying that, you know, sh she's inside of Jabu Jabu's belly. Okay, let's uh let's roll out, go back up here, and do the diving game. Unlock the scale that allows us to breathe. And then we can, you know, go down. To where Lake Hylia is. But yeah, no, uh, H Chat Nation, how are you doing today? Hopefully, you're having a good Friday. Same to you. Uh, why do I keep like messing up the the Go Jetta name? Maybe maybe because I never finished all of Dragon Ball. For those of you who don't know, I stopped after the Cell Saga. I never got to the Boo Saga, and I still need to finish the rest of that. I started watching Dragon Ball during the pandemic, and I never actually finished Dragon Ball Z. I finished all of Dragon Ball, just never finished Z, or GT, or Super for that matter. I need to go back and finish- dang chat, I'm, I'm lacking. I'm realizing how many games I've yet to play in my life, and how much like entertainment that I've missed out on. Time management chat is super important. And I am lacking in that. Yeet. Who was your favorite saga? I mean, that's fair, I feel like. Got it. 
also patience, true. Let's go get our scale. Like, all of Dragon Ball Z was awesome, but Boo felt like the appropriate culmination of the series. Uh, okay, so the exact spot where I stopped watching was after Kami fused with Piccolo, and it was during, like, the Android Saga into, like, the first couple episodes of the Cell Saga, where Vegeta got absolutely destroyed by the androids, and it was basically a one-on-one -on -one fight between Piccolo and the android. Like, after Vegeta had gotten his butt kicked, Piccolo kind of stepped in. And then we got a couple, you know, flashbacks of, like, Cell going into, like, random towns and, like, destroying people. While he was looking for Goku. That was such a great fight. See what, all right, chat. Truth be told, the reason why I stopped watching the rest of Dragon Ball Z was because of the fact that Funimation ended up shutting down, and then they merged with Crunchyroll, and I don't have a Crunchyroll account, and I haven't taken the time to actually make one. Uh, you ever watch DBZ Abridged by Team Four Star? I actually have not. I need to though. Grab the bottle. Da 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 da. <laughs> yeah, go ahead, Marie. Yeah, I'm down to watch uh, some Dragon Ball Z stuff. Alright, let's grab our message in the bottle. Hit save. I would highly recommend it. Season 1 of the Saiyan arc uh, can be a little rough. Some key moments, but Frieza Saga is where it really takes off. Yo, for real though, when they went to, to Planet Namek and they like fought Frieza and like... It, it was such an insane fight. I remember being on the edge of my seat the entire time watching, like, Piccolo's entire, like, world just get destroyed by Frieza and his team. Huh? It looks like there's something already inside of this bottle. It's a letter. Help me. I'm waiting for you inside Lord Jabu Jabu's belly, Ruta. Please don't tell my father. Well, I'm about to tell your father. Oh, my dear sweet Princess Ruta, where is she gone? I'm so worried. Sir, can you please move so I can get past you? He ate her. <laughs> no. <laughs> Gabu Jabu ate her. Huh? Wait, okay. All right, chat. I'm actually going to take a break here. So while I take a break... You guys can... Let me see. If I can try to get him in the frame. You guys can sit here and watch him dance while I go take a, a quick bathroom break and grab a glass of water. I'll be right back.
Alright, I'm back. I had to check on my dinner. <laughs> Want to make sure it wasn't burnt. Um, but I'm back. Let's try talking to him. Oh, my dear sweet Princess Ruto, where has she gone? I'm so worried. Hmm. How do I... How do I convince him? To, like, move out of the way. Is there another way around him without needing to go through the front gate? What? Come on, really? Uh, Marie, what do I do here? Show him the bottle I have. It doesn't allow me to, uh, show it to him. Wait, hold on. Oh, wow. Can't work that time. <laughs> oh, this letter is from Princess Ruto. Hmm. Let's see. She's inside Lord, Lord Jabu Jabu? That's not possible. Our guardian god, Lord Jabu Jabu, would never eat my dear princess. But since that stranger Ganondorf came here, Lord Jabu Jabu has been a little green around the gills. Evidence seems clear. Of course, you'll have to uh, find Rudo. Uh, you can pass through here to the altar of Lord Jabu Jabu. Mweet. 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 Come on, go a little faster there, buddy. Thank you, Mr. Mui. Mr. King Mui of the Zoros. <clears throat> okay. Yo, Papa! Wait, Papa, you changed your profile picture. <clears throat> Uh, not much. We're getting ready to do my least favorite dungeon. Jabu Jabu's belly. Yay. Wait, do I have to go catch a fish so he can open up his mouth? I do, don't I? Jabu Jabu's not going to open his mouth unless I have a fish here. Yeah, I need to get a fish. See, Chad, I remember. No, I believe we get the fish from Zoro's domain, but I'm not 100% sure. Let's get one from the domain. Okay. Oops. Here we go. Oh yeah, maybe we should stop inside of the shop real fast too. 300 rupees! Oh, <laughs> you could literally buy a fish for 200 rupees. Chat, is the max you can get in here right now with the small, uh, rupee bag is 99, right? I don't think you can get any more than that. I didn't want the white background in my profile picture. That's all? Ah, oh, I got you. 
<clears throat> I mean, because you get a bottle. You get a bottle out of it. I think I'll probably get a little bit further into Jabu Jabu's mouth, and then that's when we will probably end it for today. I don't think I want to complete Jabu Jabu today. <laughs> I'd like to avoid it at all costs, honestly. Yo, why does Jabu Jabu look like a giant hippo? Looks like a giant hippo with like giant like arms. I'm just not realizing that. A hippo fish, true. A hippo fish apotamus. Did you shoot today? <laughs> Yo, how was being there? There she is. You? Who are you? I am Rudo, Princess of the Zoras. What? Are you saying my father asked for you to come here to save me? I'd never ask anyone to do such a thing. Let her in a bottle, I have no idea what you're talking about. My father is worried about me? I don't care. Anyway, I can't go home right now. And you, get out of here, understand? Oh no! Are you still hanging around here? I told you to go away. I'm okay. I've been going inside Lord Jabu Jabu's belly since I was a little, but Lord Jabu Jabu is very strange today. There are electrified jellyfish and strange holes around. And on top of that, my precious stone was, but that's none of your business. Anyway, you, you go home now, understand? No, you're not the boss of me. I do what I want. Cause you know what? I am long. I am the Triforce of Courage. I do what I want. chat i think we're gonna leave it here why don't we go find somebody to raid shall we and then tomorrow we'll take on the rest of the jabu jabu who is live you know what chat why don't we go uh raid my buddy domestic fishy he popped in our stream earlier today so it makes sense to go raid him uh let me go ahead and pull up 
the stream really fast. <clears throat> Redirect. Domestic fishy. Hit save. All right, chat. We are going to do hashtag lay monster raid. And I will see you guys again tomorrow for some more Ocarina of Time. Yeah, I'm done for tonight. I think I'm going to stop here. I kind of want to go eat dinner and kind of chill out and relax for a little bit. Maybe go buy <laughs> Crunchyroll and go get ready to watch some Dragon Ball. Um, but yeah, no, all this Dragon Ball talk has got me wanting to go back and watch the anime. All right, chat. I will see you guys again tomorrow. I want to say thank you to everybody who came in and subbed. Thanks so much for stopping in. And I will see you guys again tomorrow. Bye, guys. Let's raid.